Hi everyone, I'm Allison from Highlights and I wanna share with you a couple of stories and poems from this recent issue of High Five Magazine. There's a lot of good stuff in here, so let's dive in. This poem is called Dino Breakfast. It's by Susie Levinson with art by Gary Lacoste and it has two of my favorite things in it, dinosaurs and breakfast. Cerealsaurus. Cerealsaurus wanders the plains grazing on cornflakes and great tasting grains. Frutiosaurus. Frutiosaurus lets out a roar, chomping on apples, bananas, and more. Cinnamonsaurus. Cinnamonsaurus glides coast to coast, hunting up buttery cinnamon toast. Cinnamon toast grows on trees in this world. That is awesome. Lunchosaurus. Dinosaurs start out their day with a munch. First comes some breakfast, next dino lunch. So what kind of breakfast dinosaur are you? I think I'm a pancakeosaurus or a waffleosaurus. Now while you're thinking about your favorite breakfast foods, let's read another poem. This poem is called I Like Sweaters. And as you can see, I do like sweaters. This is by Diane Moritz with art by Patrick Corrigan. Red sweaters, pink sweaters, purple sweaters, green. Brown sweaters, black sweaters, lime or tangerine. Plaid sweaters, striped sweaters, polka dotted blue. I like sweaters and I like to count them too. How many sweaters do you see? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, Six, with a bonus cozy cat on top. Seven, eight, nine, and I see 10 sweaters. What else do you see? What else do you see in this scene? I see a very cool unicorn poster that I wish I had in my room. So even though it's spring, it's a little cold here. I hope you're warm and cozy wherever you are. How about one more story? This story is called I'm Not Jose by Allison Green with art by Baru. This story is about imagination. Papa calls from the table, Jose, it's dinner time. Jose lunges onto his seat. I'm not Jose, I'm the king of the jungle. He roars and devours a forkful of broccoli. After dinner, Papa says, Jose, it's bath time. Jose saunters into the bathroom. Arr, I'm not Jose. I'm Captain Whitebeard. He sticks soap bubbles on his chin and cheeks. After Jose is dry, Papa says, okay, Jose, it's pajama time. Jose soars around his room, wearing his towel as a cape. I'm not Jose. I'm super stretchy man. He reaches under his bed for his teddy bear. Hmm, says Papa. Where's Jose? It's time for his good night hug and kiss. Jose hops onto Papa's lap. I'm right here, he says. Are you sure, asks Papa. You're not a lion or a sea captain or a superhero? No, I'm Jose, and I have the biggest Jose hug for you. Isn't imagination the best? Even if you're just at home, you can pretend you're anywhere in the world. So why don't you go give your parents a big hug like Jose did? I'm sure they could use one. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.